दुशान लखोविच how to pronounce Dusan is it Dusan Vlahovic this is how we pronounce the name Dushan Vlahovic Dushan Dushan Vlahovic Dushan Vlahovic Dushan Vlahovic What's up, boys, and welcome to the Dushan Vlahovic Players Way View episode here that is right today is the fur first first today is the first day of future stars Today is the first day of Future Stars. We get ourselves a ridiculous set of players, including the Future Stars Jude Bellingham. We get ourselves that Emily Smith Rowe. We get ourselves this Dusan Vlahovic, who I'm really, really excited about. He's a guy that we were wanting to get himself a nice little four star skill move, four star weak foot upgrade. And alas, EA have given him plus two stars in both skill moves and weak foot. Uh, so that is pretty damn nice. High, medium, 6 3. And uh, looks like an absolute crack card. We're going to test him out today. There is a card that I'm actually going to be switching my fatal Erling Team of the Year, Holland, to that we're going to test out in this episode. Yeah. And then I I just also wanted to say, I wish we kind of had a cooldown period. I don't know if you guys, for those of you guys that have been absolutely degening the Team of the Year send, I, I wish we kind of had like 24 hours to kind of chill until Future Stars. I'm really happy that we have it, but um, would have been really nice to kind of get like a cooldown period. Maybe Future Stars starts on like a Saturday or a Sunday, just so we can kind of freaking breathe, just so we can let our, our brains heal from the absolute degeneracy of the grind. But alas, here we are. Smash like if you're Serbian. Smash like for Dujan Vlahovic. Smash like if you guys know who I'm talking about when I say that Damzino looks absolutely cracked for about 130,000 coins. If you guys are new to the channel, hit that subscribe button down below. So, uh, today we're looking at the Dusan Vlahovic. There is a Chalaba card that looks pretty damn cool. So basically, you finish everything, and then you get a player pick between 88 CB Chalaba and then 88 CDM Chalaba. The CDM, in my opinion, looks pretty damn cool. Today, like I said, man, we got a couple cards that we're gonna look at. We're gonna show the Serie A some love. Like I said, Dusan Vlahovic, four-star skill moves, four-star weak foot, and then you take a look at the stats, and there's a reason why this card's going for about a million coins. 88 acceleration we're getting that jacked off with the engine 91 sprint speed goes up to 96 97 finishing with the 88 composure the 97 attacking positioning the 92 shot power uh the passing stats aren't great which is why the engine is probably the most uh it's, it's the most popular chem style on him agility goes up to 97 balance goes up to 99 dribbling goes up to 99 and then ball control is 90 with the engine chem style 88 stamina with 93 strength and 87 aggression no plate uh, no player traits to speak of and then one of the most notice mo noticeable things on the card no longer at fiorentina who is at Fiorentina is this guy, uh, Arthur Medoncha Cabral, aka Artur Cabral. For 200,000 coins, a guy that has three star skill moves, four star weak foot. For me, no real awesome traits to speak of. Just kind of isn't it. But I mean, again, with the Hunter, goes up to 99 acceleration, 99 sprint speed, has the stocky body type, 84 composure. A little bit, you know, I mean, the finishing attack and positioning is really good. Uh, 87 stamina, 95 strength is nice. Again, no real traits to speak of. And then, like, you know, no four-star skill moves. It's not a deal breaker, right? Four-star weak foot is okay. High medium. Uh, but then again, stocky body type. We're going to take him into the game. We're going to see how he plays. Maybe a center forward or something like that. But the guy that I'm really excited about is uh, is our main man, Mikel Damsgaard, a.k.a. Damzino. Four-star, four-star, lean body type. 85 finishing goes up to 95. His dribbling stats look absolutely banjax. 93 dribbling already. 87 stamina with 70 strength. That goes up to 80 with a nice little 77 aggression uh, and has himself flair. Again, no real crazy traits to speak of, but I got him for 118,000 coins. He's already up to 160, 100, 170. Um, and uh, he looks ridiculous. And I'm thinking he's going to be my fatal player. Let's get into a couple matches. We're going to test out the Damzino. We're going to be running him at Ken. Cabral, we're going to have is... Uh, uh, Cabral, we're going to have, I believe... I think maybe we use him as a left striker because Dusan uh, is... Uh, sorry, Dusan is left-footed. So we're actually going to have Dusan as the left striker. And then we'll have Cabral as the right striker. Let's get into match number one. Beginning of Future Stars. Dusan Lachovic. First thing that we like to do is we like to test out what a uh, player feels like on the ball. Dusan. We've already got Dusan. We've already got Dusan. The main man Dusan. Are any Serbian, any, any Serbian mad lads in the chat? We've got Damzinho. Again, we've got ourselves a cheeky, uh, a, a cheeky Cabral. Nice. Okay, uh, well, uh, Dusan Vlahovic, uh, it is, uh, safe to, safe to, he's got the, he's got the little chicken legs, the left post, the Serbian super lad, Dusan Vlahovic. 
So I think the first thing that people are going to be, uh, the first thing that people are going to question is, um, his body type. But I can tell you he feels super, super silky. Body faint, Dushan. and then a rip. It goes, ahead, it goes ahead and puts that in the back of the net. I can tell you, Dujan Vlahovic, the only thing that's annoying about the Future Stars cards, they've all got the Syndicate dynamic pick, you know what I mean? And then he's just got that power blast. Again, it's like I said, there's a reason that this card there's a reason that this card is gonna go for a million coins. He's done so. 3-0. Dujan Vlahovic. Uh Dujan Vlahovic was just uh Dushan Vlahovic was just way too much for him to handle. And is that Damzinho? <laughs> oh god. Alright, well, alright, so that's Damzinho. Uh that's Cabral. And then we've got ourselves the Dujan Vlahovic, who, like I said, has the uh, syndicate dynamic pick. Match number one, really nothing else needs to be said. Match number two. Dushan Vlahovic. Yeah, again, really, really silky on the ball. I think that's the first thing that you'll notice. And again, I think you're going to want to run the engine chem style on him. Dushan. Okay, why is he... What? FIFA, why are you slowing him down? I'm literally through on net. Why is he slowing down? Mad. Cabral, nice pass. Dusan Vlahovic. Oof, the lovely little, uh, the lovely little first touch from Donzinho. Again, I was not expecting to receive the ball there, so I think I, 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 I scuffed that a little bit because I just wasn't, I wasn't expecting to receive the ball there. But, uh, lovely little play from Damzinho. I think we were going to absolutely explode at the beginning of this second half. I think we were going to absolutely explode at the beginning of this second half. Dushan Lahovic. Dushan, Dushan Lahovic is just... Dushan Lahovic, there's, ju there's a certain kind of card that you just get on the game and you just know that he's going to be cracked before you even try now. Damzinho to Cabral. Nice little first touch, but again, I don't know. Feels, feels just a little bit, just feels a little bit tanky, man. And again, for 200k, I just, I don't know, man. Are you are you getting stats that you feel like are worth 200k? Dushan. Bit of a curve up. Kind of want that back in that. And even when it doesn't go your way, it does go your way with a Dujan freaking Vlahovic. What is that, five goals? Five goals in the first two games already? That's just FIFA being FIFA, to be honest. I can't really... Can't really give him too much credit for that one, but I mean, again, there is a element of ball control there. We've got ourselves uh, Damzinho. Damzinho, top end level sprint speed. That's a pen. I tried to get a little bit too cute, and it worked out for me. Uh, we're gonna go ahead. We're gonna get ourselves a cheeky pen. Uh, let's go ahead and let's give it. Uh, let's give it to the main man, Dujan. He's got himself 87 pens. We're gonna go to this way school of pens, which you switch to your opponent and you go to Penenk up the middle. He's gonna go right. That's just how it goes. Uh, and we go ahead and we make it three nil. This guy's uh, apparently wanting to stick around for a little bit more pain, but the Dujan again for for his height and his weight, and he doesn't miss inside the box either. Match number two is in the books. I think Dujan Vlaovic, uh, Vlahovic going in for another. Is that two hat tricks? Eight total attempts, four goals. Dujan Vlaovic again doesn't have the uh, doesn't have a new um, doesn't have a custom doesn't have a custom face scan. Maybe that comes at some point during the game. But goes ahead, gets himself four goals, and again just picking up where he left off in the last match. It's a card that you can absolutely dominate with. You could make the argument that if we did it in two games, that could be fluky, right? You could make the argument that two games is fluky, but if he does it for a third time, you know that the card is serious. <laughs> Distance bangers? <laughs> <laughs> Yay! Milinkovic Savage with Dujan. Things you absolutely love to see. The Serbian, uh, the Super Serbs. The Super Serbs. And it's like I said, even when it doesn't go his way, it does. That's tough. <laughs> One of these. It's got really nice ball control. Nice little, uh, again, yeah, he did. For, for, he, for a big man, he just... One of these. And then it's around him again, almost. Cabral. Mourinho. Do you see the dribbling? Do you see the dribbling? You see the dribbling on this car, dude? Dujan Vlahovic. Remember the name. King Kai had a Future Stars, uh, Kai Havertz had a Future Stars card, and again, correct me if I'm wrong, he had a Future Stars card 
in 19 or 20, or might have been foot, no, foot birthday was, he had, he had a crazy foot birthday in FIFA 20 or FIFA 21. Kai had a ridiculous Future Stars card. It was his first, like, nuts card in Ultimate Team in FIFA 19. And I think he literally had the same dynamic pick that we've got uh, the Dujan, on, on the Dujan Blahovic. I'm getting big time King Kai Havertz vibes. Pelota dominada, buscando gol, está el conjunto de Matlats. And he's just, he doesn't miss, bro. He gets into the box and the guy just doesn't miss. This is maybe one of the most broken striker cards that I've used in the game. You guys know that I don't like spending a million coins on a player. Uh, I mean, like, uh, you, you guys know I really, really, really don't enjoy spending a million coins on a player. But sometimes, I don't know, man. Didn't get near enough touches on the Cabral. So apologies, boys. I can't really give my clear-cut opinion on Cabral. All I can tell you is that Dujan Vlaovic, in three matches... Three Hatties. There are so many really good strikers in the Serie A, but this is... He might arguably be, he might arguably be the best striker in the Serie A, boys. So if you're, if you're still trying to operate on a budget, there are some guys that you could use a, a, a la Federico Chiesa or Lautaro Martinez. If you have those two, uh, that might be all you need um, because Martinez obviously has that strength. He's got the 88 strength, 89 aggression. So if you're happy with a combination of Lautaro and then Chiesa, for example, or maybe you ha still have the Luis Muriel or maybe somehow you're running the, the, the Zlatan Ibrahimovic, uh, this Vlaovic card is absolutely ridiculous. So, I mean, I don't think he's a must- uh, I don't think he's a must-get card, but if you have a million coins, I gotta implore you, just get, try him out. Just try this card out. He's super fun to use. Four-star, four-star. Gets massive, massive upgrades. And it's not often that I would give good ratings for a player this expensive, but Dujan, things that we were able to do with this card in-game, again, is it's his ability to kind of whip around players. Maybe it has something to do with his attack positioning. 97 finishing. You don't miss anything. He feels super, he feels, he feels super, super rapid. Obviously, with the engine chem style, you could get the hunter on him, but I don't feel that you need it. I think it's much better. Uh, the engine is much better spent on this card. 99 dribbling, 97 agility, 99 balance, 90 ball control. I, I mean, I, there's o there's only so many superlatives I could say about this card. I'm going to go ahead and it's, again, like not often that I give a, a four-star value rating on a player, but I'm going to go ahead and give him the first ever, I think post, uh, I, th I think uh, I think upper over a million coin card uh, value rating, four out of five in terms of uh, in terms of value, in terms of on the pitch performance, I'm going to give him a four and a half out of five. This guy made, uh, this guy did everything. Silky for a big man, uh, was able to get around defender super, super easily. And the most important thing with a guy uh, whose job it is to score goals, it is not something that is going to let you down on this card. So again, Dujan Vlahovic card, really, really fun. Damzinho and Cabral wasn't even, wasn't really able, wasn't really even able to use them just because we were having so much fun with this Dujan Vlaovic. Uh, and uh, yeah, that's going to do it for the first Future Stars Epi, boys. Uh, again, the Chalaba card looks really fun. Uh, the Future Stars token. Future Stars, as of today, has every uh, opportunity to be as OP as Winter Wild cards. I suppose it depends what we get over the course of the next week and a half, two weeks uh, throughout the duration of the promo. I think there's going to be a Team 2 as well. Um, so maybe you guys let me know. What do you think about Team 1? What do you, th what do you think about Dujan? What do you think about Cabral? The, uh, the SPC card. Um, who's your favorite card? Who you're trying to get your hands on? And uh, yeah, boys, I hope you guys did enjoy the episode. Your card type is just absolutely beautiful. Smash like if you guys did enjoy the epi. Smash like if you guys are new. That Smash like if you guys did enjoy the epi. Hit that subscribe button if you guys are new to the channel. We'll catch you guys for another Future, future Stars and Fatal episode of tomorrow and Sunday. Till next time, my bros. Tschüss. Later. Ade.